everybody, welcome back to XCOM 2. We've got a supply raid mission that we are able to embark on. Uh, this could be a nice little boost to our early finances, uh, so there's no reason to ignore it. Uh, we are going to take out the same squad that we had set up previously, and that's going to, in fact, be Old Timer, who is from the character pool, so that's pretty cool that it just overwrites everything. Uh, we're going to take out Pious, Cannibal, Fire, and Singer. And, uh, I think we're all loaded up correctly. Let's just check here. Do we have any additional upgrades? No, we don't. Okay. I love this. I love his armor. That's very cool. Old school haircut from XCOM, Enemy Unknown. I love it. Okay. Let's, uh, let's jump in here. Deploy in position for deployment. One of our contacts in the resistance tipped us to an advent transport they managed to disable when it passed through as part of a larger convoy. Advent security forces are already moving to gather their assets, but we've got a shot at finding something valuable here. We'll have to secure the area, recover the gear, and eliminate any enemy resistance. The interesting thing about supply raids is. We can damage that and bring less supplies back, um, but we can use it for explosive damage if we really want to. One five. The Wouldn't recommend it, but... Convoy is just ahead. Engage and eliminate all hostile forces. All right. Preliminary scans detect absolute darkness. Good. <laughs> so let's bring, uh, let's bring Aeneas out and let's start scouting early. There's no rush, but if we can get eyes somewhere, that would be great. I actually think staying back here with uh, Loxley is a pretty good plan, uh, considering the squad site Moving out. Overwatch now. Got it. Let's run way over here. Stepping off. And Cannibal, grab the cactus. It's the best cover. Wait. That worries me. That we may have just evacuated everybody off of this high ground cliff. And then we heard what we just heard. Hmm. It's something to think about. But at this point, I think that's all we'll do with it. Let's bring Aeneas in here. No, there's definitely something back here, and now I'm freaking out. Moving to position. Good copy. Moving on target. Show on Let's leaks. rotate back. Moving to position. Moving to overwatch. Enemy movement ahead. Yep. Okay, we're on the right path now. So let's see if we can't have Aeneas find this group. This is an there we go. Combat unit. We oh my god. Vulnerabilities if we're going to take that thing out. It's part of the risk <laughs> of this particular supply raid mission is stun lancers and mechs. So. Uh, we'll have to be careful. We've got concealment. We can definitely get into a much better position than what we currently are in. Affirmative. Moving out. Old timer, you want to be? Uh, you want to scout up there? See if Running. there's anything else going on. Cannibal for now. Hang back here. Roger, I've got my eyes on. Moving to Overwatch. Okay, they may be heading into the. No, there's. They're not gonna make it into the house. 
But I feel as if we just got a little sneak behind sneak peek behind the curtain. Potentially enemies inside the house. The uh, the squad site here is nice. And we are taking a little bit of a uh, penalty, but we've got the height advantage and we have the scope, so it's really helping us. Hmm. Closing on target position, no. I think we keep getting close. We actually have a really good target there to take down if we want it. We also have we also have the grenades, which might be a really good option as well. But if that's the case, we would have to kill Closing have to kill the stun lancers now. ASAP. That's the equipment we're after. We'll have to do our best to avoid destroying the gear while we secure the area. But I think, I actually think that we can, that we can handle that. So, let's take the grenade. Let's hit this group, blow up that, that, uh, tank. Hopefully shred all of his armor. Let's just, take let's see that. what old timers got here. Okay, not bad. We almost killed the mech because of the, first, the fuel tank. Advent deployed non-lethal stun units for crowd control and the occasional protest. We don't see a whole lot of that anymore. No, we don't. Alright, so... Stun Lancers are a pretty big priority. But we also have to worry about him, and if anybody's grouped up, more than likely... He will want to launch rockets at us. Uh, this guy's potentially flanked if we had a better position. But I'm wondering, I think we might be able to hit both of those. But we may put our supplies at risk. So it's risky. All right, well, we need to move Singer up. Confirmed. We don't currently need Shredder as it stands right now. And we've got Cannibal. He's got some armor. We shouldn't be afraid to, to move him in there. Even if he takes some hits. So, for the greater good, do we want to destroy some of these supplies? Or is it possible that we get out of this without that? Let's see, we've got 74% on this Stun Lancer here. Let's go for it. There it is. <laughs> My god. I'll never, I'll never doubt you again. Then we can take down this mech. He's shooting. Enemy eliminated. And now we've got additional options here. Um, a stun lancer shot here would be really bad. Um, grenade from both of them would kill him. She's not able to reach. So I'm thinking what we do, I think we're going to suppress him. If he wants to move, that's that's his prerogative. But at least he'll be out of cover. Or we could just take the 50% shot here. Let's do that. We should have done. Oh, nice. Okay. That's all right. We wasted a bit of a few bullets, but we've held on to a lot of different um, explosives. So this is great. We did break concealment, so we no longer have that to rely on. Let's 
Let's start grouping up a little bit. Moving out. I'm on the move. Moving on target location. But first Moving problem on solved. On and uh, these guys were pretty much on point that entire engagement, so... On round of drinks on me. Okay, let's do some leapfrog here with Singer. Headed there now. Orders confirmed. Moving out. We've got Enemy action. Okay, that car looks fancy. Car sure looks good. Well, one of these guys hopefully dies here. There it is. Jeez. <laughs> oh, I don't know why it just pumps me up every time she crits. Like, she's on point. Loxley is like, she's doing really well. I am uh, very honored to have her. All right. Cannibal, we need to go for the flank on this soldier here. Let's bring you in. There it is. And then I'm tempted to move her up here, like, I really am. Um, but I'm not going to. I'm gonna pull these guys back to full cover. I always, like, assume that the sectoid's gonna act how we would expect. But I know he's gonna catch me off guard at some point, and I'm gonna regret that. So, let's go ahead and grab cover over here. No, he's running! Okay. Could be worse. Let's see if Cannibal spots anything. Not quite. Okay. Moving to designated coordinates. Moving. Time to bring up Loxley a little bit. Moving to designated position. I'm on it. Come get some. On over. Back cover. Need to fire shots. Okay. Let's keep going. Good copy. Moving on target. Nothing just yet. Relying on this car for too long uh, could be a giant death trap. Moving to position. Moving to position. And we'll keep, uh, we'll just keep Loxley up here. Okay. Providing high ground squad site cover. On overwatch. Scanning. Overwatch. Scanning. Keep the fire shots. Let's take confirmed. a peek. Moving out. Nothing. Okay, been on Tavix. Moving to designated coordinates. All right, singer. Position confirmed. Grab that other door. I love the way that these doors open. These are called uh, they called suicide doors or something. I like that. Moving out. Covering now. Covering now. Get My God. Was ist da drüben? All we're doing right now is we're hunting, and we want to still maintain any advantage that move. we can get. Heading to that location. Moving out. Moving Let's on keep target location. Johanna in tune with the squad. Affirmative. Covering now. Oh, I hate when that happens. There we go. Oh, old timer. 
Okay, let's move to the tree. Polo. Where are these things? Heading there now. Oh, something's happening. I can feel it. We've got our there it is. Hello. Oh, wow. That's good of them. It's a good spread. We're gonna go on the soldier. We have a better chance to hit the sectoid, but... This is gonna be her last shot before she needs a reload. Nice. 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 That's all I can say. Amazing. Keep up the great work. Now, we actually have, like, we have a couple of near 50% shots on the trooper, and then we can let the sectoids kind of do their thing. Or, we could almost guarantee the kill on the trooper, still have a grenade left over. I think that's what I'm going to go for. Give these sectoids something, some distractions. Good setup, Polo. Now we just need to deliver. Affirmative. Moving out. Old timer's got a promotion here. Let's see if Pius can't take him down. Not quite. <laughs> and those are the shots that we miss when they just stand in there. Let's go, Reed. Well done. It's got some loot. Kill confirmed. I'm running low on ammo. Well done. And we can actually flank this guy. Leaves us out in the open. And again, like, I know these sectoids, they're going to change up their tactics at some point. It's going to catch me off guard. But until I see that proven to me, I'm going to keep Order using what we've location. learned to try and get an advantage. There we go. I'm thinking these are our last two to four enemies, depending on if he brings up a side zombie or not, but, um... Oh, okay. At least he's not near the supplies. Front of the truck has blown. Doesn't seem to impact anybody. Nobody cares. Oh, never mind. Damn. <laughs> that's uh, that's awesome, actually. <laughs> that's really cool. I mean, it's cool for us. For sectoids, it's pretty much all bad news. Uh, I just want to see: Are we in flanking positions here? I mean. We are, if we want to just stand in the open. I've got nothing with Loxley here. Um, we could go for all these flanks if we want. Let's start it off with uh, Luce here. Nice job. Very nice. I'm thinking what we do is we have Samantha come in. And actually we'll have her do the... Do the grenade toss. She's already got a promotion. We could go ahead and try and blow up their truck, too. I don't think there's anything in there we need to worry about. 
Actually, what if there, what if aliens were inside and I said that so confidently and then huge mistake? Let's avoid that for now. Okay, so he's out in the open. Pius is working on a promotion here. Try and bring him a little closer. We could go for the sword. But, I mean, just in case there's enemies back there, I don't know if that's our best plan. So let's not go any further than our Rolling. rook is. Beautiful. Oh, so good. I love this team. Got him. Is that the end? Weapons burning, I'm fast. Status confirmed. Beautiful. All hostiles are down and the area is secure. Status confirmed. Mission accomplished. Let's move out. Good job, troops. So, most damage. Old timer, rookie, making a mockery of the other soldiers. Um... Not to say that anybody didn't do well. I think everybody did well there. Nobody was under fire. Uh, we were able to dispatch of all those troopers. Pius made the most attacks. And uh, Robert also moved the furthest. It's cool. New record for damage per attack. It's because we got a lot of those flanking shots off. Thank you. in the field have certainly encouraged the crew. All right, so, uh, old-timer promoted. That's cool. Congrats. So he's a specialist? All right. Now, we're definitely going to grab, uh, Shadow Strike here so that we can get additional benefits from Phantom. And then the next level, we're going to grab Concealment so that we can reconceal and reuse Shadow Strike later on in a mission. A lot of times I'll wait to make these depending on what type of uh, missions we're going to get, but... Um, so Shredder, Suppression, Demolition... I think, I think we go Suppression here. Okay. Everybody's looking good. We've got a Laser Sight and an Expanded Mag. Stun Lancers are coming back. Mechs are coming back. This is all good stuff. The uh, the mech can help our specialists actually quite a bit. Uh, Stun Lancer can help our, our rangers quite a bit. Let's see. We're still waiting on a promotion for uh, Skinner here. We'll make that decision when he comes out next. It's been a while. Advanced Warfare Centers almost built. What's going on in here, in the tactics school? Oh yeah. That's impressive. That's impressive. Look at... Look at Pius back here. He was just out on mission, like, doing work, and he's already... He just keeps working. It's impressive. You gotta admire that... That work ethic from him. Oh, there it is. The black market's almost open. This is a good sign. This is a good sign. So, uh, let's actually head there. New course. I, when those come up, I always like to ignore them just to remain in our same spot, not to waste a few hours of, of flight time. Um, just to kind of gather information on what we were doing previously. Uh, we started making contact here, but black market's certainly important, so let's check this out. Skinner's back, and it's open. The market is open. So they're interested in Illyrium crystals, sectoid corpses, and Illyrium cores. Interesting. Uh, I'm actually like, I think the Illyrium cores we should hold on to, but if we needed to sell them, we probably could. Illyrium crystals is something that we can't use just yet, so uh, if we need to sell, we could also sell those off. Uh, we need a bunch of trooper corpses, we need officers, we need pretty much everything else. Um, these guys could probably get sold if we need additional money. 
So let's see. What else do we have here? So we can rush research on plated armor, but we need 120 intel. I don't see that happening anytime soon. Uh, Advent troopers or sectoids I'm not too interested in. Um, but we could use some of our intel to grab a scientist here if we wanted to. That'll increase our research speed pretty dramatically, which would help with our mag weapons that we're working on. Uh, we also got uh, perception, which would be huge. This is a nice, like, permanent bonus to aim. And this does impact our swords on our rangers as well. If they have the PCS chip, um, makes those a little bit more uh, reliable. Ooh, this is a tough call. I can't get both. I'm thinking mag weapons on everybody is better than plus 10 on somebody. So let's grab a scientist. This is going to be Dr. Sen Van Albada. Or, actually, hold on a second. Before we make that decision. Setting course for Sector 8, Mexico. We might be able to buy our scientist with some additional Welcome cash that we have here. We could buy an engineer. All right, so it's that's right. Sniper Wolf's the engineer back here, uh, which isn't a bad idea either, to be quite honest. How are we doing at the base? The more engineers early, the better. We could start clearing out additional things, which gives us some money. Um, I think that's the right call. Welcome, Commander. But then we can't get wet work. This is another thing to consider. Uh, but we could if we sold some of the stuff that we don't need. <laughs> Let's get this engineer going. They're so valuable early on. Uh, we'll go back Avenger to the black market. New sell a few of those things we don't need currently. We can always use them later. And we can always get more later too, so. Uh, let's sell some of our Illyrium crystals. Sell some of the sectoids. And I think it was 150 for wet work, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, wet work is 150. Let's grab that. And actually, we have to staff the engineer. So let's Commander, get Sniper I Wolf. I you recruiting new staff for the engineering team, but as it stands, we have people still waiting for an assignment. We can have them working on construction, excavation, or staffing a facility. There we go. Sniper Wolf is in, clearing alien debris. Um, what we could maybe do, since that's going to take so long, we could have her hurry up on the relay, but then again. We have nowhere to build once the relay is done, so... Yeah, let's well, just keep clearing reference. that out. I've got plenty of time to focus on learning to fly this boat. From what I've seen, you could use the practice. <laughs> I love that little banter between them, between missions. Okay. Now, the only other option that we have to decide upon... Is, open. ...is do we want to buy this advanced perception? And as much as I want it, I think we just need to save our intel right now uh, so that we can afford to rush plated armor because we're already working. Um, we're already working on our... Uh, where is it here? Magnetic weapons, which isn't going to be too long. Market is open. We could go with the scientist to speed that up, but... You know what, let's do this. We're grabbing the scientists, we're gonna knock that down, get mag weapons going faster. And uh, hopefully everybody's happy. Setting course for Western United States. It's a little bit of a risk there with the intel, but we get other opportunities to gather intel, so. To establish local regional contact. We have another supply drop coming soon. Avatar Project is making progress. Commander. The aliens continue to make progress on the Avatar project. If we're going to slow them down, we'll need to move fast. Let's not panic. Let's not panic. Let's 
supply drop coming in. Well. Commander. We've Another alien facility. The aliens have completed a facility devoted to their work on the Avatar project. If we can establish contact with the local resistance forces in this region, we can make a move on that facility and destroy it to set back the aliens' operation. Okay. I was talking about this last time, but don't panic too much about the Avatar Project progress. Okay, we've got a mission here right before our supply drop. Neutralize target in an advent vehicle. Oh, I like this. I wonder who the target's gonna be. That's the best part. And look, tons of intel, tons of supplies. This is awesome. Golden sleep. That's uh, interesting. So now it may have a door, may have a locked door. We probably, if it's advent, probably have some towers to work with. Um, just taking out a specialist is a really good idea. So Skinner here, let's decide on your promotion. Um, the way I kind of look at this is right now, if, an, if we get hit, uh, we're gonna be fine to live, but the challenge is that if we get like stunned or we start to bleed out, then we're in a little bit more trouble. I, as much as I love combat protocol, I think we're going to use medical protocol now. And uh, once we get up to the additional uh, first aid kits, then we'll... We can... Actually, we can even buy one now so that we at least have two. Because the gremlin comes with one. Except we don't have any supplies, so forget that idea. Uh, let's bring out Loxley. We kind of want to keep some of our top tier guys and uh, making sure that they continue to get promotions but we can also bring out some of our lower level guys um it's almost time to recruit some some rookies too it's almost time let's see we can bring out two rangers a sniper a specialist we definitely need a grenadier And maybe instead of... Actually, we should be okay here. We've got lots of explosives. It's, uh, quote-unquote, easy. So, even if we have some of our lower-level guys here, we should be... We should be fine. Uh, I can't wait to change Grelite's tattoo color. <laughs> but for now, let's give you a, a better-looking gun. And you're a classic, so classic for you. All right, we've got laser sight, which obviously makes a lot of sense on our rangers. Do we have anything on Pius? We don't, so let's go ahead and throw laser sight on him. Getting that extra crit chance. We also have an expanded mag, which isn't a terrible idea with our grenadier. It's not bad. It's really good on sharpshooters, but I gave her the uh, the scope for now. Oh, he already has one too. He's got the repeater. Well, let's hold on to the expanded mag, but we're gonna take out Skinner, Loxley, uh, Aeneas, Grelite, and Polo. Wish me luck, guys. See you next time. Bye. you once knew is no more. Earth is now ruled by the Advent Coalition and their alien masters. 